Hello friends, I am Harinder. Yesterday one of my students, Neha, came to me and asked about, so what is the strategy to crack analytical reasoning and logical reasoning section of the CET Maharashtra exam? I helped her and thought at the same time, why not to help the other students who cannot reach us in person so that they can also crack this very section. Right students, so before we discuss a few of the questions and the strategy for the reasoning section, just have a look on the kind of questions which appear and the number they appear in. Students, uh, usually logical reasoning section has 50 to 55 questions in this exam as the number keeps on varying sometimes 48, sometimes 50, sometimes 52. Similarly, there are visual reasoning questions which are a great, great percentage in totality also form 25 to 30 questions in total of this very exam. So let's solve a few of the questions. I'll leave a few questions maybe for your practice as well. Let's solve it here. The first question students here you have to select a figure so that the series gets continued. Now students here, if you try and see and analyze uh, the leftmost figure given here has a water image here in the next figure on the left hand side bottom. The figure on the right here has a water image here on the left hand side in the next figure. Similarly, this figure has a mirror Im uh, water image over here and this figure has a water image over here. So we try to take the water image of this letter. So water image of this has to start from here only if you try and have a look. First option contains the exactly the same letter which cannot be the answer. In the second, third and fourth, the position of the downmost line is Suppose it to be this, but that is given to be like this. So that cannot happen. So on that logic, 2, 3, 4 gets rejected. And your answer for this question becomes fifth option. Right, students? Now, after that, this question. There's a question based on symbols, wherein the examiner defines the symbols in an indirect manner. Just for your hint, if you say this means it is neither smaller nor equal. So something which is neither smaller nor equal has to be greater. So this signifies, this implies P is greater than Q. Right students, let's go to the question and solve it there. So we have to mark answer 1, 2, 3. And if none of those follows, we have to mark it as 4. See, uh, P at the rate Q means it is neither smaller nor greater. So this means at the rate means this is greater hash signifies neither greater nor equal that means this implies it is smaller neither greater nor smaller so dollar sign means it has to be equal uh, percentage means it is not greater so it is not greater means it is less than or equal to students now and signifies it is not smaller, so that means it is greater than or equal. Now well, let's solve it here. A at the rate B, now it implies A is greater than B. Dollar is equal, now B is equal to C. Then it says C is less than D. Now students mind it, the approach is you have to keep the symbols on the same side. So if C is less than D, we should write it as D is greater than C. You see the options. First says A is hash means A is less than D. You can see they can be either equal or D can be greater or A can be greater. So you can't say anything. B at the rate B is greater than D. You can see B is not greater rather B is smaller. So even this is wrong. So both 1 and 2 are wrong. So answer to the question shall become fourth option which says neither 1 nor 2 is right. Moving on to the students. This is just same kind of a question so you can solve it. The answer to this is the fourth option. This one it's a syllogism question students. Uh, we have to mark the answer. It just says some blue. So I should write blue as B E and black as B A. 
some blue are black some black are gray the students here some black are gray then it says all gray are red now let me draw here all gray are red and then all red are pink right students now all gray are red and all red are pink now see this is blue this is black this is green this is red this is pink now some red are black you can see some red are black it is definitely true second is some pink are black you can see some pink are definitely black even this is true after that some pink are gray you can see gray is inside pink so some pink as gray is also true now some red are blue you can see red could be something which is not intersecting with blue as this circle is red and this circle is blue so fourth is not true so answer to the question is 1 2 and 3 follow right students after that here it says all essay are speeches right so this becomes essay this becomes speeches and this becomes translation and then no essay are reviews so we have to make the circle which does not intersect with essay so this circle is named as review so students mind it relation is this cannot intersect with this so let's see some reviews are speeches you can say it may be true but not necessarily no reviews are essays it will always be true no reviews are translations you can see there could be finally no review are speeches you can see this could be no answer happens to be that only second is true if you go through the option students you can see only second is given here but at the same time you have one or four and you need to check it for the complementary pairs you check first is some review are speeches and fourth is no review are speeches no one and four make a complementary pair students so the answer to the question shall become choice number 4 it is either one or four and two right after that this question you have to see which contains figure x as its part now this figure given here is the figure x students so you need to see one by one all the options given here when you see this sign you can see this is very much visible here in this option right students so answer shall become the fourth option moving on again the same question which figure contains the figure this x over here if you try and see students firstly this if you try and see which figure matches it completely i'll mark it with green color for you you can see this then this straight line and then this trapezium kind of a thing at the bottom you can see this thing and then mind it it is not the first line which will be true it will be the third one so the answer again becomes choice number 4 moving on students this one it's a series question uh, see the numbers it is 8 9 10 11 so you can see 12 will come here when you just see the options 12 is given over here students which is your answer otherwise the second scenario is 12 13 14 and the number com coming here will be 15 moving on to the next question this one now students it seems a typical series but the logic is very very simple it is 3 plus 2 5 and then it is 35 standard then 10 plus 2 12 then it is 35 then it is 17 now doing plus 2 you will get 19 and then it has to be 35 so answer is 19 and 35 choice number 3 shall become your answer right students moving on this question here uh, it's a coding given in terms of words best way to win has four letters four words four codes theek hai the way to hell is 
this way so let's go to the questions first one now students here we want to know the code for the word mi firstly we'll see where are the uh, this code given mi is here and besides that mi is here just see the words common here students out of the best way to win and win of the day which happens to be the common word students the only common word here happens to be win so what shall become our answer here our answer will be word win second option moving on students you want to know the code for the word best if you just see it here best way to win is coded as this the students you see best word is here and if you try and look the other words given the way to hell win of the day and then to sell of night best word is not appearing anywhere so this means the code which has the only appearance in the first one shall become your answer if you see the code add code add is being repeated over here so this cannot be the answer if you see the code me mi this is repeated over here so even this cannot be the answer if you see the code ja j a it is repeated over here so this means the code for the word best happens to be no which is given in the third option right students after that this one here we have to find how many such symbols are there each of which is immediately preceded by a number no symbol preceded by a number means number has to occur earlier than the symbol so the best way is see the numbers followed by a symbol so if we see the number over here students this is the first number 7 but followed by a letter 2 followed by a letter 8 now here the number 8 is followed by dollar which is a symbol so moving on 5 is followed by j 6 is followed by f 3 is followed by c so if you can see there is only one such number which is being followed by symbol which i can call symbol is preceded by the number right students so the answer is fourth option so right students i hope you all gain from this and attempt your lr and ar section questions in a better manner in the cet maharashtra exam as this is a reasoning video soon you will be able to see the videos on quantitative part as well and verbal ability as well right that's it from the team bozai thank you so much happy learning